The next deployment site that was not Manchester. That was definitely not Manchester on the map. That Manchester's like 200 miles further north than where we landed. Okay, so we've got to rescue this guy. The VIP for this operation goes by the name of William Thorne. He's an influential politician suspected of collusion with the aliens. We need you to bring him in alive for questioning. Get him to the Sky Ranger for evac. New objective received. So wait, hang on, was that... Over here, was this the... Oh, so have we landed... The Sky Ranger. R right, so we've landed the Sky Ranger and we've just got on like a little jolly to over here. Oh, we've already picked him up. Okay. This is absurd. Do you honestly think I would turn my back on my country? I am not a traitor, damn it! Good. Hold well on, mate. Um, right. So, yes. Um, we're actually the latest on the card game, for those of you who are familiar with it, is we've. Um, just make sure we're not being followed on this side. Uh, is that we have launched it, and that and that's great. They're all available online. There's an Imga link which I'll put I'll put in the comments for this. Um, oh god, I've just realised that Newton's in command. Um, um, and, and at the moment, we're actually waiting to hear from a few funding sources. So there's quite a few um, people like Athena Swan, for example. There are, there are charities that are all about trying to improve women's representation in science uh, who are interested in, in giving some funds to make physical decks. Um, if you're one of the lucky pe people that have actually received physical decks already... unusually human in its appearance. They could be using it as an infiltration unit of some kind. I'd recommend capturing it for further analysis. All right, let's just round you back. Um, yeah, because uh, we well, we did produce a few. Sorry, that was probably really loud. Uh, we did produce a few decks, which were sent out to teacher friends of myself and Hannah. Um, so there are a few physical decks that already exist, but just not that many. Right, so what's, what's the deal here? You're crouching over there. Let's get... no right to do this! I work for the people! On whose authority do you operate? Why do you have an American accent if you're a British politician? Just a thought. Just a thought there. Right. Galileo, is there any way you can get up on the roof? No. Okay. Is it ludicrously dangerous to send you out on your own? Yes, probably is. Okay. Well, given that we've got Mary Somerville on top here, who on her first mission has been entrusted with scaling a building and taking out this dude. Can you see anything? No, okay. I'm not even going to ask Newton if you can see anything because the answer is very clearly no. Oh, no, sorry. Okay, well that makes my job a little bit easier. Newton, blind, doesn't know anything. He doesn't know where he is. He thinks he's uh, in Coco Cabana or somewhere like that. Hang on, can we... Does that actually negatively affect our accuracy? No. In the original game, it negatively affected your accuracy if you sh fired after moving. It was way ahead of its time in the original. But it, my god, it was so... Like, we've actually... This is way more forgiving as a game um, than the original ever was. The original was just brutal. Like, the first... You could move a soldier out of the Sky, the Sky Ranger and they'd just die. that will be it. Should have put you in Overwatch. Damn it. Caroline Herschel there, the uh, sister, not wife, as a lot of people seem to think, of the famous... In German, scientist um, William Herschel. Let's get you out there, Galileo. I will not speak to anyone until I'm given proper legal representation. So does that mean you're not going to move, or what? Hmm. No, 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 no. 
You can be seen. Let's move you back. Newton's on Overwatch for what it, little it's worth. You know, for being one of the greatest minds in human history, you're really bad. Just saying. Uh, okay. Let's try not to get... That was Caroline, wasn't it? Let's try not to get Caroline killed. Newton? No, still nothing. To be fair, like, actually looking at where they are, I can understand why you wouldn't be able to see anything. The way that map cuts out like that is really disorienting. Yes! You managed to shoot right through the wall. And create a nebula from the looks of things. Galileo, you're not in cover. Let's just hope there's no one with eyes on you. Who's got the medic? Oh, no one's got a medikit. Bollocks. Oh, he's off. Do I put you on Overwatch or do I tell you to hunker down? Mm, put you on Overwatch. Right, let's run you over into cover. Newton, you blind old bat. <laughs> I love this. I'm, lo I'm really enjoying ripping into Newton like this. Strike one. You've got a wave of X-rays closing on your location. Eyes up. Where did he come from? Did he just fall from the sky? Come on, Herschel. Uh, that's like the end of um. Oh, is it Point Break where he fires the gun into the air because he can't shoot his dad? Thing is, I only know that having watched uh, Hot Fuzz. Oh, come on. Newton, yes. Come on, get a kill. Check him out. Oh! What a shot, Newton. I'll take it all back. That was really cool. And as cool as, like, murder can be cool, you know. I don't condone murder in any way. Unless, I suppose, like, murdering the, the beings which are trying to take over your planet, that's, that's probably about acceptable. I'm rather a pacifist. Uh, I... I when, you, when, you're, when you're talking about killing in this situation, I think it's very important that you never glamorise it. There's still a set toy over there. Let's not forget that. Let's get your head down. All right. Oh, and that's the end of Caroline Herschel. Come on, Newton, avenge her. Avenge me! Oh. Newton, you're going off my estimations. That's. To be fair, it wasn't. What's this? What's this over here? Wait. Just like pul pul pulpy. Blah, blah, blah. Can't use my words. Pulpy kind of a movie posters. Um, there was definitely another set toy. On the side there. How are we going to get down? I've just realised this. Oh, you can just jump. Okay. That's good. Galileo. This isn't so bad. This is this is a relatively easy mission. He says. Watch as it's... Oh, it goes tits up! Alright, um... So hang on, where are they? It's just there. With our undefended spacecraft. With its... <laughs> with its ramp down. Okay, let's run you to there. Wait, what? Oh, Newton's already shot. I'm just so used to him not doing anything. Right. Let's run you up here. My logic is, like, by dashing like that, I'd rather, if I'm going to die, I'd rather know what's going to kill me. So you can't see anything. 
Yep. Let's just wait for this guy to make a move. He might take a pot shot at Newton, we'll see. Mm. He's definitely down here. Galileo does have a grenade. Thing is, I can't actually see where the saline is. Let's, let's try this. Uh, oh, God, this is a messy interface. Right. There he is. <laughs> Got the little bugger. Okay, we're almost in range. I am not going to move the politician out, though, until I know that there's nothing that's going to kill him from this side. So that's... Okay, so we've just we've got to kill him. No one's <laughs> He just he just dropped from the sky right behind her. What did you expect was gonna happen? It's Mary Somerville! She was a badass! She has an Oxford College named after her. What did you expect? William Thorne. Is that no that's not quite. Not quite. Newton, let's just put you on Overwatch. These guys, they're just like the roof crew up here. Let's get your head down. Okay. Okay. Let's run. Let's run. Let's go, 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 go. Where are you taking me? I demand answers. VIP is safe and on board. Well done. Now you just need to eliminate any remaining hostiles. We have a new objective. Uh, right. How big is the map? I realise that that's the kind of question that kills all realism in these kind of things. Oh my... Oh no, okay, it's the... Jesus, I thought I'd have to clear the entire damn city. Okay. I'm relatively confident that there's nothing down this way. Having said that... Yeah, use your words. Uh, I'm just going to use Galileo to check. Ugh. <laughs> I hate being right. <laughs> Equally, I hate being wrong. I suppose I was technically wrong there. Ugh. Right, Galileo. Um. Right, let's get you down there. There's no goose being on the rooftop if there's just... Oh, you're landing in a pile of puke. Must be university town. Where were we? Manchester, apparently, yeah, definitely. I like Manchester. I was one of my um, one of my choices, actually. There was, a, there was a really awesome guy there called Fred. I don't, know, I don't know if anyone at Manchester doing physics can confirm that Fred is still there, but um, he he did this really awesome talk um, for for admissions, which sold me and my my dad. I remember that. Moment. So my dad and I, we did this um, like universities. Tour. Oh, that was it. We did this like university's tour of um, uh, it was like Manchester, Leeds. Uh, I went to. I oh, know he didn't come with me to Imperial, but basically all the stuff up in the north that I was looking at, Durham. That was it. Um, we kind of did this road trip. It was really fun. Highly recommend checking out the unis that you are going to, uh, whether you're applying to, because there's nothing like actually getting your boots on the ground and and seeing it. Rip, rip, Caroline Herschel. That was um really unfortunate. Newton though, Corporal Newton. Squad site, that's the one. So this is the one that if if he can't see an enemy, but then I move somebody ahead, like I tried to do a Kepler before. That's really useful. This is also useful, but um, yeah, not not as useful as that. Somerville, run and gun, nice. 
Galileo. Yep. There's a portrait of him in the Bodleian. I remember working and looking up at him, and it was like, oh my god, it's that famous picture. It's really weird. The inside of the um, the inside of the oh, new new ah, brilliant. Yeah, the the inside of the body has, has portraits everywhere. It literally looks like um like Hogwarts. Commander, we've suffered a number of casualties and have yes. suitable replacements yet. We, we just start hiring additional soldiers through the barracks. We hang on, we've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven now, and well these guys haven't actually done anything yet. Sergeant Jack Williams. Hmm. Let's think. British. Um Abilities. Oh, so I actually get to choose. Right, so he's he's support. Smoke and mirrors or field medic. Mm. We've already kind of started specialising um, Kepler into being our medic. But is it worth having another one? No, nah, that, that's that's make it a little more interesting. Let's have a second. Let's, let's have a second, you know, specialist. So, British physicist in about the time of Newton, who incidentally is wonderful, and I take back everything bad that I ever said about him. Let's think. Actually, maybe that's a good time time to end this. I've been playing for quite a while, I think. Um, so, if you have a suggestion for a physicist from like the seventeenth century, who's British. Um, then, or a chemist maybe we can probably push the chemist. Then let me know. There's still, I'm 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 disinclined to promise that I'll do like a person per episode because that tends to get people killed. But um, I have still got a lot. Kepler's one of my favourites actually, and we haven't talked about him very much. Um, but he's the next guy. He's the next guy with the chopping block after Copernicus. Um, so yes. Right. Well, thank you very much for watching, and uh, I will. Look, I look forward to hearing what you guys are suggesting I should name this guy in the comments. And uh, yeah, I will, I will see you for the next play session. Thanks for watching.